This is not a crime if you love the movie uh, Knives Out, which I think actually was the last movie I saw in a movie theater. So uh, Netflix is going to shell out big bucks for, for this. Tell us more. Yeah, Netflix is putting their money where their mouth is, and they have pledged to commit $450 million to secure the rights to the Knives Out sequel. That's according to multiple reports from both Deadline and Variety. And this is something that I was shocked at. It's a very high number. It's actually the largest movie streaming deal in history. This is a ton of money that Netflix is throwing here. And I spoke to an analyst, Santosh Rao, on this, and he said, look, you really shouldn't be that surprised. For 2021 alone, Netflix has committed $19 billion on content. So this is really just a drop in the bucket. And this is something that not only do they want to do, but something that they absolutely need to do if they want to be able to compete with all of the other streamers that are out there, Disney+, Plus, Amazon Prime, Apple. They're all, they're, they are all getting very aggressive when it comes to uh, trying to get as much content on their platform as possible. And with Netflix, they have well over 200 million global subscribers. So there's an expectation there that they are going to have the strongest content. So they're willing to put up the big bucks in order to get that. So it's certainly a good thing for Netflix and their position in the streaming wars. And I'm excited to see it. I, I hope uh, that it comes out soon because the first one was very good. So, Ali, real quick, it sounds like then if, it, if this makes sense and the analysts aren't surprised about this, that we could expect more of these types of deals going forward. Absolutely. And I think specifically for Netflix, who they're known, right, for spending a lot of money on content. This is not anything new. And that's why I also think you're not seeing too much happen with the stock. I think investors largely expected this to happen. This wasn't that too big of a surprising move. And at the end of the day, content is king. Movies are important. Sequels are important. So I think you can certainly see some more of these deals develop over the next few years. All right, Ali Canal, thanks so much for breaking that down for us. And we should mention that Netflix was one of the winners here in today's market with shares closing up more than 